um, starting this video in the bathroom. Probably not the coolest thing ever, but I kind of don't care. You can hear that? That's birds. It's, um, about 5, 5.25 in the morning, I'm missing. And I just woke up, hence the raspy throat voice. Um, I work, but first I'm meeting up with a friend, and that's not the fun part, so don't worry. Um, then, later, I'm going to meet back up with said friend, and I'm going to to CAF, the Toronto Click Arts Festival, so that should be fun. Um, I'm really looking forward to it, but I'm not much of an early riser, so... This whole waking up at um, 5 in the morning thing is not my favorite thing. But anyway, that is irrelevant. That's beside the point. You know, whatever. So I'm going to this festival. That should be fun. I literally just woke up. So that's why I've got a nice head on. Um, yeah, I don't know. That's about it. So I guess stay tuned for that. Excuse me while I go work because a bitch has got to get paid, you know, I'm broke, so That's life. I don't know. I'm gonna brush my teeth get ready do some shit Pill time and straw time Yay. Coffee <laughs> Say hi! Hi, hi, hi! Welcome to my room. It's actually my mom's room that I kind of took over because she doesn't live here anymore, so like... Cool. Okay. So the good thing is my work uniform is at work, so I can wear basically whatever I want to go there. But, um... The bad news, so my hair is a mess and I'm gonna have to brush it. And one, that's gonna hurt. And two, that's gonna hurt. I have to meet my friend at 6.20. It's like way past that time. Actually, it's not way past 6.20, but it's close to like 5.45 by now. 5.50, I'm gonna be late. I'm terrified. Okay, who knew brushing my hair was gonna take like the longest time ever? I think I did, but like I just didn't want to admit it to myself, so now my hair looks disgusting. Right? Right. So what I do now is I take these front ends here and I just kind of go like this and make it look presentable without having to do a lot of work because I'm lazy as fuck and I just don't care enough. You know what I mean? Yeah. So anyway, time to put clothes on. I don't know what I'm doing. Please, seriously, like, if someone help me, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm changing my pants right now, and you guys can't even see it. Can't even tell. You know why? Because see my camera only goes here up. Because why? Because low quality, I film on my phone. Thank you. And I have it set up on my mirror. I'm so sad. See, when you're broke and can't afford a camera, and this is what you do in your life. When you're broke and can't afford a camera, but still want to be famous, like, gang gang. 
Let's put some pants on. Don't worry, you guys will get to see the final look at the end. They're high-waisted, so you can see a little bit. I'm gonna freaking die. I want to blow my nose so bad. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna just throw jokes. I lied. <laughs> time and that's gonna be really fun but like low-key it's not and I'm not excited but adventure I guess right right
just walk around outside. Which way? I thought it was going to be any direction. Who is this way? I'll just go this way. around outside, inside, everywhere, literally everywhere that I could possibly go. I ended up on the other side of everything at one point. And I have one last chance to find this. So I'm gonna go do it now. Good luck to me. So after all that running around and everything, I sat through the panel and I got the signature. Woo! I will be honest, it's really stressful because I'm socially anxious, but I did it for my friend whom I love. So it was worth it. And now I'm excited to meet back up with her and show her this lovely cartoon signature and everything. festival and let me just say that was honestly such a great time like so many amazing artists were there so nice everyone there was so nice and like super chill which is great because I'm very socially awkward so like mm, that don't work for me too well but everyone was super chill sorry I thought I saw a bug that was terrifying but everyone was super chill and super nice and just the whole thing was so cool and there's so many great artists like I cannot describe to you how many great artists there were like it was insane and even at that panel i went to for my friend where i got her book signed for her um i didn't really know the author or anything about the book but when i went there i actually learned a lot like a lot of good i guess tips and life lessons that don't necessarily need to apply to like manga or if you're trying to become an illustrator or anything like that like just for any sort of project you want to work on, which is kind of great for me right now because I'm starting this whole YouTube channel and I'm really shit at it right now. But she gave a lot of really good advice for like starting out and things like that. Sorry, my hands are shaky. I've had way too much coffee today because it's my addiction. Anyway, I really hope you guys enjoyed. Also, oh, before I forget, let me show you guys something cool. The lighting's gonna get really shit for like two seconds and I'm just gonna hot and cold okay anyway sorry now it's like still shit but like less shit you feel? but anyway i got this postcard from my friend it's toronto yorkdale so like you can see the cn tower in it and stuff i would point it out to you but i'm holding oh i guess i can wait hold on let me use my face to show you guys something anyway that's the cn tower up there if you guys couldn't tell but i feel like i probably could and it's just like the streets in the winter and stuff around like the Yorkdale area. Which I really like because winter for me is kind of a really pretty season. Like I really like it. So anyway, I got this postcard. And um, I got it for free, which I love because I am so broke I can't stand it. And um... <laughs> I got it for free because my friend ended up buying like a lot, I guess, considered a lot of stuff from the artist. And so the artist said, oh, you can pick like a postcard for free because you bought so much stuff like as like a thank you kind of thing. And my friend, because she's so sweet, 
she let me pick a postcard for myself. And I think that's super sweet. So I got this nice souvenir postcard. I think honestly, it was just a really great experience. And it's so nice to see people who put so much effort into their work get a chance to like showcase it. Especially at an event like that where everyone's so nice and so chill and just friendly. And everyone's kind of working towards a common goal of like, teaching each other about different things and showing each other cool new things, I guess. So I think that part of it, I really enjoyed. There were a lot of people there, so that was a little scary and hot, but it was fine. I also had work, so it was like a little bit tiring once I got there because I was like, ah, oh, I've just worked for like however many hours, I don't know. And um, yeah, but I'm home now so I can rest. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I really do. Um, I don't know, like usually people are like, oh, like subscribe, like click the notification bell, la la la. So like maybe, I guess maybe I should say that. I don't know, like if you want to, click it, go for it, <laughs> be my guest. I would appreciate it i'm not gonna lie but you know i only have like with this two videos out so i mean i don't know i don't know i guess if you're like down to join the journey and go for a bit of a fun ride i'm a mess but i can guarantee that i am a fun mess most of the time fun and real i guess so if you're into that Feel free to like and subscribe, comment any of your thoughts, I don't know, and yeah, I guess hit that notification bell if you're into that, <laughs> and I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace!